Did you know there are thousands of microorganisms living in our skin and inside our bodies, and each of them needs a hospitable environment to thrive? Did you know that some of those microbes play a protective role in our health? Hi, I'm Dr. John Charles with NASA's Human Research Program. During the one-year International Space Station mission, NASA will conduct a microbial study to learn more about the effects of weightlessness on microbes. The collection of microbes, known as the human microbiome, contribute to the processing and absorption of nutrients in our body and protect us by competing for resources with other organisms. A microbiome study will be conducted to determine how the human microbiome changes during long-term space exploration and to evaluate its potential impact on an astronaut's health. On Earth, when faced with various forms of stress, such as lack of sleep or poor diet, we can develop allergies, congestion, or skin conditions. For those with immune deficiencies, a loss of some species of microbes could lead to an altered metabolic function, increasing the chance of infection. In orbit, stressors such as weightlessness or radiation can cause the same reactions. By sampling the microbiome of astronauts on Earth while they're in peak physical health and during subsequent times of stress, including long-term exposure to weightlessness, G-forces, radiation, and changes in health status, this study will better define and identify response triggers. Samples of crew members' saliva, blood, perspiration, and stool will be collected, as well as surface samples from air vents, sleep quarters, exercise equipment, water dispensers, and the bathroom area, to be correlated with hygiene and environmental factors such as temperature and humidity. The results of this study will help researchers better understand the effects of space on the immune system, which could help prevent some illnesses and diseases in space and on Earth. To learn more about NASA's Human Research Program, visit www.nasa.gov.